Unyu, unyu. He's here. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Hello, everybody. How are you all doing? It's Len here. Welcome back to another video. Now, you may notice that I have my messy backdrop. And I was thinking of going to my normal, you know, background with the bed and the butterflies. And I thought, it's a gorgeous, gorgeous day outside. I mean, seriously, gorgeous day. So I'm just gonna sit in front of my open balcony doors slash windows and just have some natural lighting in here. We need some sunlight. We need some sunlight up in here. So music is a huge influence right it can influence your mood you can put some happy music to get like all peppy when you're cleaning or something i don't know but music is a great big influence and i've always wondered if music can influence my my style of drawing how i draw my my maybe my line quality my drawing the emotion and the atmosphere in my drawing etc etc and that is exactly what i'm going to test out today i've made up three playlists of about 30 minutes so i filled them with songs and it's about 30 minutes i haven't like it's not exactly 30 minutes but it's about 30 minutes and we have one playlist i've named aloud so it's more up tempo loud maybe more on the angrier side of the spectrum music so looking at it now i have some like drum and bass, some Skrillex, some metal, rock and roll, more upbeat, fast paced, uh, louder, loud type music. So that's one of my playlists. The second one I named emotional and it's more sad music. I don't want to say like, oh, this song is a sad song because it's going to be different for everybody. So I just named it emotional and we have like cinematic orchestra um, what else did I put in there I don't really remember I think I put like uh, maybe fix you by Coldplay which always always makes me cry things like that more emotional type songs I'll go over the playlist with you once I'm in front of the computer and the last one obviously is I just named it happy because they're more like uplifting happy songs uh, I put some Disney in there I put some some music that warm my heart for me personally I forgot to mention that I chose music that I do like myself uh, that do touch me in, on different levels on a more energetic level on a more emotional level and on a happier like happy-go-lucky level so these are songs that I like you obviously and unfortunately won't get to hear them because I don't want to get copyrighted but I will show you what songs I have in the playlist um, and I will try to find copyright free music to like give you an idea of what I was listening at that moment so what I'm gonna do play a playlist and then just draw sketch um, during 30 minutes and we'll see what comes out at the end of it now I've been giving this a lot of thought I didn't know what I was going to draw until uh, maybe <laughs> up to yesterday and I was like maybe I should draw the same thing three times but that will just give like the third playlist an advantage because it'll be the third time I'll be drawing it so no I'm gonna draw three different things but I'm gonna be drawing three people like more portrait style but not um, not real life or anything I'm gonna have a reference image and I'm just gonna draw how I feel I'm gonna be basing myself on the emotion which is the whole point so reference image which I'm going to glance at glance and then I'm just gonna sketch I'm using Photoshop which is kind of scary for me because sketching on Photoshop is not the most effective way for me anyway but if I want to show my body attitude and show what I draw I'm gonna need two cameras and the best way to do it is just film my screen yeah I have this camera so we'll just have to make do with what we have yeah wish me luck guys I'll see you in a minute when I get in front of the computer okay guys this is the setup I've managed to come up with let's see if it works out because when I draw I'm like hunched up I know it's really bad I haven't yeah so 
welcome to my setup. I got my uh, phone. I've got Photoshop open right in front of me on my Wacom Cintiq tablet, and I've got my playlist ready here. So let's run through them really quick right now. So in my loud playlist, I have some. Chemists, Enzo Shikari, Sesin, Linkin Park, Rammstein, some Skrillex, Prodigy, and some Pendulum. So I hope you get the idea behind what I'm going for. It's gonna be like up tempo, upbeat, um, screaming, shouting, loud music. Um, and I'm probably gonna start with this one so it'll give me a bit more energy and then I'll go to the happy and end with the sad I think that's the order I'm gonna go um, in in my happy playlist I have now bear with me these are my guilty pleasure songs some of them we have the Lion King circle of life yes uh, Shelter by Porter Robinson and Maddie Ann. We got Owl City, Ariana Grande, Chainsmokers, uh, Walking on Sunshine by Katrina and the Waves, Call Me, Way Call Me Maybe by Carly Rae Jepsen. Yes, I told you, guilty pleasure songs. Uh, Valerie by Amy Winehouse and Rather Be by Queen Bandit. So these will be my happier fancy songs. Oh my god, I'm gonna make weird faces and be mouthing music and singing and dancing, aren't I? I didn't think this through. <laughs> and in my emotional slash sad songs we have, like as I've mentioned, Cinematic Orchestra, Sia, Ellie Golding, Radiohead, oh somewhere over the rainbow, I forgot I put that one, Coldplay, um, oh I put The Scientist, not uh, Fix You, oh well, uh, Lord, James Bay, oh my god, and Passenger, I'm gonna be bawling my eyes out, my A's out during this one, so without further ado, pray that my camera battery holds at least during 30 minutes. I think it holds over, just over 20 minutes and then it cuts and then I'll have to restart it. We shall see guys. We're gonna give it a go. This is my first try. Fingers crossed. Big ass glasses on my nose. Let's go. One camera battery down, one playlist down, and I'm gonna go actually go to the emotional sad slash sad one right now. So 
let's get right to it. happier music because now I'm feeling very heavy-hearted and melancholy and a little blue so let's go ahead and jump right into the happy playlist <sighs> last one <laughs> Done, and by we, I of course mean me. <laughs> 
So yeah, two battery packs and one SD card uh, emptying later. Three drawings are done, three playlists have been listened to, and this is what I've discovered. So the first drawing, the angry drawing, let's just call it that. Um, I noticed that I felt more nervous, less focused, and a little bit more all over the place. It could be because it was my first one. I was a little rusty on the Photoshop sketching, and I always get nervous when I'm drawing with a camera on. It's like somebody looking over your shoulder when it's drawing, so it might have contributed. But I think the music played a big role in me being a little less focused and um, not knowing what to do, not knowing where to go, feeling a little restless maybe as a word. Um, and also I was enjoying the fast beat and wanting to move around so not very focused on what I was doing. So that's one, that's the first point. For the second drawing, it was um, calmer music, soft music, more emotional music, and I've noticed uh, straight away that I was drawing much slower, uh, my strokes are softer, the whole overall drawing is much lighter, and I felt, I definitely felt more focused since it was calmer. So that's for drawing number two. One of the things that I need to take into account though is that at the end of that playlist, I felt pretty down. I felt pretty like a little blue on the blue side. So even though I was way more focused and I was feeling much calmer while I was drawing and in the end, uh, I feel like that drawing is less attached to my reference photo. I feel like I just uh, was in the zone during the whole thing. In the end though, I didn't, I wasn't in like the most uplifted emotional state. I felt a little down. So that's something to take into account. And for the final drawing, that's the one that is the least completed out of the three. I wasn't focused as I wanted to be. I was listening to the music and having fun with it. And I was, and in result, my focus dropped. Also, it could have been because it was the last drawing and I was also interrupted because I needed to do a battery change and then I had to empty the SD card because it was full. So that is something I need to take into consideration, but I was enjoying myself much more. The only thing though is that I was less focused. I was a little bit more all over the place, not as much as with the angry drawing, but definitely less focused as with the sad drawing. That is my first impression after I just completed those uh, drawings. Looking back now, I can see that the mood and the atmosphere is clearly different uh, from one sketch to another. I feel like every drawing does reflect the overall mood that I could have been, that I felt during the three phases. The first one, the colors are definitely darker, more patchy, uh, less polished, so maybe more jittery, more nervous, maybe even more angry, and her expression is a little stern. I think it's much more stern than the reference photo I had for that picture. So that might actually be something to take into account. Same with the second one. She does look a little more melancholy than the reference photo. So it looks like the music does change the atmosphere of the drawing, so that's really interesting. Whereas the third one, even though I think she was pretty neutral in the original reference photo, she does have this little sparkle in her eye that like not not like literally, but she has like this little grin, this little sparkle in her eye and I don't know, she feels it feels a little cheeky and I don't know, I don't know what I'm saying, but these are just my uh, conclusions sort of from this art experiment. Now it does seem in conclusion that it's a good idea to uh, choose your music carefully when you want to be focused. It might be very obvious, but I've always wondered how it was influencing me personally. Now I'm curious about you guys. What type of music do you listen to when you want to be focused when achieving a certain type of task where focus is needed? Let me know. Let me know what you thought. Maybe you saw something that I didn't see, noticed something that I that evaded me. Be sure to check out my other artwork on social media. I actually do finish pieces now and then, so please check them out. All the links are down below. If you aren't subscribed yet, please be sure to do so. Leave me a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you all very soon in another video. I release weekly vlogs every Monday. I also release main videos every Thursday, though recently I've been doing it only every other week week so I have more time to collect ideas so we'll see how it goes but subscribe 
ring the notification bell so you're notified first of my newest videos and I'll see you all very soon in another video. I'll word you all. Bye.